I bought the Blood Team DLC, so you won't have to. Police and P recently came out with a brand new DLC, this time for the NHS. It allows you to grab a motorbike or car and transport blood bags from point A to point B. But first, since it's my first video on Police and P, what is it exactly? Police and P is a UK based 5M server where you can roleplay as police, a paramedic, a firefighter, or even national highways. Whatever you want to do, they have something for it. You could join in via the description below. And while you're there, feel free to hit that like and subscribe button so you never miss out on more content like this. That's all from me. I hope I didn't waste too much of your time and enjoy the video. So I did check out if it worked in the game, and so far it does. We're gonna spawn over at St. Thomas. And they have their own division. Dude, they have their own f division. How cool is that? Right. I say we take out the Fort Focus. Right, let's see. Does it have sirens? It does have sirens. I like those sirens. They have... <gasps> Dude, what? We could do... Dude! Start a mission. St. Thomas. We're at St. Thomas. What the f***? What? <laughs> so we had to deliver a blood box from St. Thomas to St. Thomas. That might need to be a little bit tweaked. I'm not gonna lie. Right, let's see here. Great one to Sandy. Here we go. This siren sound is something else, dude. Like, it is so different from the regular siren she hear on this game. We're just cruising. We're chilling. Right, we're gonna have to go off of the highway here. Right, so I don't really like the handling and stuff on this, uh, on this car. But it might just be because of the snow, if I'm being honest. Does it have reds? It does have reds. Oh my god, yes. Oh, wow. Yeah, that might be a little bit of an issue. Hey, uh, <laughs> I don't think it should be underneath the map. Start mission. St. Thomas. Oh, f We're just gonna drive from this end. I don't give a shit anymore. <laughs> I do like how quickly it pulls up, though. It's still grade one, so we still gotta do, like, lights and sound. I wonder if there are different grades to this as well. Alright, so I might try the blood, the blood Team DLC again when there's like no snow. Which is probably like after New Year, so we're gonna... What the f*** are you doing? You absolute moron! You need to be shot at the spot! The nice thing about the Blood Team is that it's just deliveries. So you just go back and forth. You don't need to be on like radio or anything. Which is what I like. It's just if you want if if you want to do something chill yet still be somewhat helpful on the server, this is the shit for you. Right, this needs to go to the Victoria one. Oh, we're going back to Polito boys. Let's see if we can get a delivery without crashing. Yeah, we're going for that smooth drive now. We're going extra careful on this one. I like to think that if you crash, you actually damage the blood back. There we go. Like a glove. I do some... I do wonder how fast this thing can go, though. So we're gonna speed it up a little bit. See how fast we can go. 111? I think 110 is just about how fast you can go with this thing. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot of requests to double crew right now in the chat, as you guys can see. Mother Right. Now that we have that delivered, before we go on to the next one, I wanna check the boots. Oh, just a regular boot. Nice. Good stuff. All right, we're going back to St. Thomas now. Let's actually try without crashing this time. Well then, <laughs> I blame the snow, dude. This would not have happened if there wasn't any f snow. We're now going to be trying the motorbike. See if we get anything special with the motorbike. Mount Zona. Alright, let's see. Where do I need to deliver this thing? Ah, right here. There we go. Oh, we need to go back to Polito. Here we go. Wonder how fast this thing can go. I think it's about the same speed, 110. Yeah, it's the same speed, 110. 
Cars don't seem to s to pull aside for the motorbike. From what I can tell. Which is good, because that means that I can avoid them e more easily. Right, so the main reason why I'm not on as uh, RTPC or anything right now is because of the imminent terror threat that's going on right now. Every single division is taking uh, safety measurements. Like double crewing, no motorbikes, <laughs> giggity. So yeah, there is a terror threat going on right now. I gotta go take a shower, cause I'm looking at a dirty piece of shit. <laughs> All right, on to the next. St. Thomas, great one as well. It's all gonna be great one, isn't it? Is there not gonna be like a great two or three? Ooh, we got the wheelies. Wheelie. This is way easier to do than the Ford, the car. Wee woo, wee woo. <laughs> wee woo, wee woo. <laughs> Yeah, it's way easier to not crash with this. Hello, I got your blood. And now we're going straight back to Victoria. <laughs> How to not drive when you're driving in response. <laughs> that is exactly why. Oh, and we're going back to St. Thomas, right? We're just going to go back to St. Thomas. Oh my God. Chaos ensues. <laughs> so that's that. My honest opinion, it's kind of worth it. I mean, I personally enjoy making deliveries, but if it's not your thing, then I wouldn't get it myself. There are some bugs like, you know, the sandy circle, menu not refreshing after uh, delivering a blood box, vehicles not pulling aside for the motorbike, and the word blood at the front being mirrored. But I do believe that these will be fixed in the future. I do hope that there will be more uses to this DLC, because as of right now... <laughs> It's very basic. Hope you guys enjoyed though. I'll see you next time.